everybody, welcome back to Samsung in a Minute, the channel that trains you on your Samsung Galaxy devices in around two minutes. Today, we're going to talk about the Google search bar widget. So right out the bat, this thing's going to look like any other phone, any other Samsung device that's walking around the world today, and you might want to go through and customize it and make it yours. So all you'd want to do is click on that little G button, and then on the top right hand side, you're going to see this little icon. And then once you're up over here, you can head over into settings. Now with inside of the settings, this is where you go to search bar widget. So this is where you'd be able to customize the widget and you can really make any and all of the changes that you would like to do. So first off on the bottom, you have four different tabs. This first tab is dealing with if you want to see the word Google or you just want to see the letter G. Now, once you choose which one you want to use, don't hit done just yet. That basically means that you are completely done with everything. So on the very bottom, once you get done with all the tabs, you hit on close. Now for this one, this is how you want the bar to search or uh, you know look like if you want it to be a complete rectangle, if you want it to be a little rounded or fully rounded. I'm usually a big fan of the fully rounded. I'm gonna click on close. This next one will be all of the different colors of the G and also you know everything that's kind of around it. So you can go with a very clean look if you want it to be white with the kind of a black G. This one you can have the black background here with the, the white G or you can go through and then you can actually change to whichever color you would like to use. So I'm going to go with this red color, uh, but I also want to kind of bring it down just a little bit, make it a little bit darker. Uh, and then I'm going to hit on close. And then you hit on close one more time, it takes you back to this main page. And this is where you can uh, have it be a little bit more see-through or solid. So if you want it to be a solid look, you can have it go over there. If you want it to be a little see-through, you know, depending on which background you use and how hard of a, of a look you want it to have, you can kind of go through here, take a, you know, change it around, move it around, see what you want it to look like. You hit on done. Now, if this is exactly perfect and where you want it to be, this is where you hit on done and you just hit home. Now, the last thing that I usually like to do is, is make it to the size that I usually like to use. So I like to go with this one here so I don't accidentally click one of these icons and I wanna make sure that I'm clicking you know, with inside of the little search area. And then I usually bring it on down. So that is how I'm able to customize my Google search bar widget, You know, make the home screen look a little bit different than everybody else. Uh, and you can also make it match your wallpaper, things like that. So hopefully you guys appreciated this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Subscribe on the very bottom left-hand side. And if you like this video, then more than likely you'll also like this video. And I'll see you guys later.